I was curious to know whether Kent Hovind had an opinion about climate change. I don't think there's climate change. Really? First, I doubt there really is climate change caused by man. Now, there may be climate change, but it may have all kinds of other causes, <laughs> okay, unrelated to what man is doing. The fact of the matter is that climate is changing. Each decade since the 1950s has been warmer than the previous decade. If it was purely down to natural causes like the sun and volcanoes, then over this period of time the Earth should have been cooling, but it hasn't. We know that carbon dioxide is a greenhouse gas, and we also know that human activity has been adding carbon dioxide to the atmosphere in an increasing, at an increasing level since the Industrial Revolution, and we're past 400 parts per million now, which is some 40% higher than it was at pre-industrial levels. We're also adding methane, um, mainly due to intensive beef farming, um, and then there's also the melting of permafrost in Arctic regions, um, which is like a positive feedback loop. Um, so as the earth gets warmer, more permafrost melts, and that uh, increases methane levels. Um, and methane is a much more effective greenhouse gas than carbon dioxide, even though it doesn't stay in the atmosphere as long. I think it's some 20 times more effective as a greenhouse gas. Um, then there's also the fact that um, humans are cutting down trees, deforestation, and that leads to desertification. Um, and then there's also cement production. Um, that requires um, a huge amount of energy, and it also adds a lot of carbon dioxide to the atmosphere, um, mainly due to limestone, which is used in the process. Lime Limestone contains carbon, so during the process of making cement, more carbon dioxide is added to the atmosphere. I mean, what, what the stuff that we do, you know, when you burn fossil fuels, natural gas, etc., coal, it produces carbons into the atmosphere. I understand. I taught biology. I know how the carbon cycle works. At least he calls coal, oil, and natural gas fossil fuels. I know a lot of young Earth creationists have a problem with this, but that's uh, that's at least something, I suppose. But the plants absorb it right away, and it makes them grow faster. Yeah, it's right away absorbed back in and locked into the uh, uh, into the soil and into the wood and into the carbon-based products. So no, I don't think man could affect the climate that much. So you don't think man could affect the climate that much? You claim to understand the carbon cycle, yet you seem to demonstrate um, a lack of understanding about the carbon cycle. It's not just a case of you release carbon dioxide into the atmosphere by burning fossil fuels and then immediately all of that carbon dioxide is absorbed by plants via photosynthesis. It's not as simple as that. It's not as quick as that. The rate at which humans are adding carbon dioxide to the atmosphere is increasing, as I said before. Um, the amount of carbon dioxide the plant world can absorb is decreasing because of things like deforestation. It's also connected with the um, plant life in the oceans uh, and phytoplankton. That absorbs a lot of the carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, but the fact that the carbon dioxide level is increasing year upon year upon year shows that we are putting out too much carbon dioxide into the atmosphere for the natural world to be able to absorb at the same rate. It's not rocket science, and um, it can be clearly seen by the fact that the levels are increasing. I don't think there's climate change. The Earth is getting warmer, Mr. Hovind. 
and human activity has a lot to do with it. It's pretty obvious. Anyway, I've got to go now. I don't have much time to make videos these days. Um, there is a couple of my older videos which have recently been blocked worldwide, which um, I don't think that most of my old videos have particularly amazing intrinsic value, but there's a couple of them which um, I put a decent amount of effort and research into, um, which I'm going to re-edit and re-upload. It's the one of them is about plate tectonics, the other one's about limestone. Um, so you may not see a proper new video from me for a while, but I shall attempt to re-edit those ones and re-upload them soon. Anyway, thank you for watching, and see you next time.